From our Stars and Dogs segment, it's time for this week's Star. 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 Yeah, Sorora Cannabis, the star of the week. The symbol is ACB on the TSX. Trading at just over $8 today and a market cap of just under $8 billion. So on August 14th, the stock was trading at 534 and then just over, just since then over the past week, the, the stock price has jumped about 51% to over $8 per share. So Aurora is one of the world's largest and leading cannabis companies. It has funded excess capacity, of, funded capacity of 570,000 grams per year and sells and operations in 14 countries across five continents. It's the second largest cannabis company in Canada right now. So what is, what is driving the stock? Well, on August 14th, the company announced that it had completed its acquisition of an Anandia Laboratories, a cannabis-focused science company specializing in genomics, metabolite profiling, plant breeding, disease characterization, and culti- cultivar, cultivar cert- certification. This led to a 19% jump by August 15th. Then after that, the, the stock jumped another 18% following the settling and record date for the spin-out of the company's subsidiary, Australis Capital. So looking at the financial results, very strong growth in revenue in, in Q3 2008 over the previous year. Revenue was $16.1 million compared to $5.2 million in the quarter, same quarter in the previous year. So that's growth of 211%. Unfortunately, the net loss also grew. Uh, adjusted EBITDA was uh, was negative 6.9 million for the quarter, compared to a loss of 1.8 million in the same quarter the previous year. Very nice balance sheet, uh, lots of net cash, about 80 million in net, net cash. And like our star of last week, Aurora is one of the biggest players in the cannabis space, um, which has seen tremendous growth over the last few weeks. Massive revenue growth from last year and increasing gross profit coupled with the company's supply agreements that will kick in upon Canadian legalization in October um, makes Aurora's growth potential exciting to say the least. It doesn't right now meet our criteria. Nevertheless, massive gains with great revenue growth and acquisition activity we've seen from this company and that makes it our star of the week.